Automatic weapons fire over northern Lebanon. The target, migrating birds. Every spring, millions and millions of birds make their way from Africa to Europe. Lebanon on the Mediterranean coast is a key transit point. Our observer goes out every day to count the dead birds and rescue the wounded ones. People are shooting everything actually that flies. Uh, starting from the big birds to the small birds. They shoot eagles, buzzards, kestrels, pelicans, uh, white storks, black storks, common crane. Sadly, they are shooting in massive numbers and unstoppably. No one is stopping them. People started shooting by using war guns like AK-47, M16, VAL, and many other weapons that are used in war. In one day, I reported 15 pelicans and 30 storks in one town. And it was massive because during that day, more than 700 storks and pelicans were shot just for fun. And we know that the birds of prey are not edible, actually. Neither the storks or the raptors. And many times I found uh, dead birds and sometimes I find wounded birds. I just simply take them to my rescue center to do the medical assessment. Dozens of videos on social media show birds being shot down over northern Lebanon this spring. The poachers show off, even though it is illegal in Lebanon to hunt less than 500 meters from residential areas and illegal to hunt migratory birds. <laughs> Many of them are from species that are protected, like this white stork rescued by our observer. I found someone who was shot in his garden after she was shot by a chasseur. He was kept in his house for some days. He put a plate on it, which was very well placed. On the chaque chaque jour, à peu près 10, 15 uh, uh, oiseaux de gibier, de cigognes et de pélicans. Malheureusement, la, la majorité de uh, auront une, un handicap physique à cause de la blessure qui qui qu aurait uh, dû à la chasse illégale. Michel says this stork will live, but spend the rest of its life at his center. The birds he cannot save, like this one with a broken leg, will not survive. 